you very much for giving me the opportunity to say a few words. I apologize for having not been here this morning. I was busy with something else. Um, so I, I thought back when I first time met uh, Yvonne Chokebrue, and actually the first time I met her was uh, one time uh, I was a student at Ecole Polytechnique. My teacher in analysis was Gustave Choquet, and I called Gustave for Gustave Choquet for a seminar, and then she answered the phone. So, so that was my first exchange with uh, Yvonne Chokebrue. Later in this uh, in this year, actually, the, the students organized a seminar on general relativity, which was uh, interesting because the person in charge was Bernard Moret. For some of you, that's a name that you think, and he did totally different things. Uh, later on, he did uh, geometry with Banach spaces, but uh, he was the one organizing the seminar on general relativity. So he was the one that Gustave Choquet told him that he should talk to Yvonne Choquet. Well, I was not the one who did that, although I took part in the seminar, but uh, that was it. And then uh, my contact with her later on was really through the book that she wrote with uh, Cécile, uh, um, Cécile uh, Moret de Witt, and also another author wh whom I forget always the name. Um, anyway, so, but this book has been for me uh, very important because uh, it showed uh, a remarkable way of uh, getting uh, geometry and uh, physics uh, together. And I really used it quite uh, extensively to learn new material and so on. Um, and of course now the next moment where, where I really interacted with uh, uh, Yvonne jocré and when I started to actually work on your paper, because you probably know I was one of the referees, so I spent a year just reading this uh, 460 pages paper, which was a very challenging uh, thing, but a fascinating thing. Uh, and uh, of course, then I looked back at what was the uh, initial papers and so on. So I looked at uh, Yvonne's paper that you quoted. By the way, just to prepare the lecture I gave in uh, in Vienna, I looked back at the contrary note that you wrote in 1950. I couldn't understand anything, that, <laughs> anything you were saying. Of course, the paper itself, which is what 82 pages long, uh, that you explained very clearly. I mean, it's really a very sophisticated st structure going from one step to the other and and so on, which is remarkable at the time because uh, the, I mean the. Uh, the uh, methodology was not totally established. There were steps already, but uh, there was a lot to... She really introduced a lot of new things and uh, on the basis of others, but nevertheless. And of course, now I don't want to hold you too long. For, for what, for something which was very important is when she retired, we, we knew, and uh, Thibault was instrumental in that, that she would be interested in coming to IGS. So we made sure that she could come and and she came very regularly, more or less once a week, and it was a fantastic opportunity to talk to her about math, but uh, physics, but also other things. And one thing which struck me was really the 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 way that she was always finding the right words. I mean, she she was so specific about saying things the right way. Uh, it was um, uh, amazing and really. And one instance which was ex uh, exceptional was when she was chosen by Cécile David Moret, who was who got the Légion d'honneur, uh, being officier de la Légion d'honneur. She chose um, uh, Yvonne as the person who would introduce her to to this. And the speech he gave at that time, I just read it back because it's in my computer. Um, it's just an amazing uh, piece of uh, clarity and uh, really identifying what are really the key, uh, the key element. So we appreciated very much that she came. We had a fight with her because we wanted to pay her a taxi to come here because she was living not so close. And she had to take two subways to, to come here. She always absolutely refused. There was no way we could convince her. But And she was 80, she was uh, 85, she was 90. No, she was still coming with using the subway. And you know the subway is not always so nice. Uh, I'm sure you had some bad experiences with that. So that was one thing. And uh, we were very, very pleased that she accepted on two occasions to celebrate her when she, was, she turned 80. And uh, almost 10 years ago when she turned 90. So, so we are, the institute is very grateful for her because she also brought to the institute a number of her collaborators, uh, Moncrief and uh, Stanley Dazer and a few others. 
and of course working with Thibault more, most of the time also, but she definitely brought some uh, activities to the Institute in a very direct way because of your influence, because of her also capacity to interact with people. So these were the words I wanted to say, to say how uh, the great admiration I have for her and uh, just the the way life goes, it just happens that uh, I became quite close to a, a son, Daniel, who is a biologist, who got several ERC grants and is also uh, a panel chair of, of ERC. So I, I met Daniel several times in Brussels and he was really a, also inherited from his mother, really the, being very precise and so on. Thank you very much.